No, nope, nothing happening. All right, let's get around here. We had a couple strikes and that was it. So. What is causing our dilemma? They like the gold. Are they just not digging the uh, <coughs> chartreuse? Or? I don't know what to think about on this one. We'll go a little bit farther up and try a little bit more. And then if all fails, we'll switch out. Maybe we'll put something smaller on. I don't know. Smaller worked better the other day. Maybe that's what they're looking for here. So it's more of a smaller presentation. Some easier prey, I guess, eh? Yeah, these trout are really light hitting it. They're like swiping. They're not really committing. So it's gonna be a tough bite today. It's gonna be even tough to land them because they don't have a net. Jeez, I can't believe I didn't bring my net. What the heck are you thinking? You probably weren't. <sighs> oh well. If you look ahead of me here on this river, it's really sandy bottom. Oh, with this river, you gotta fish this stuff. And this stuff is tough to fish and not get snagged up. And I've been snagging left and right today. But you gotta get in there, you gotta drop it, you gotta take your chances. That's why I'm building your own lures, it's kinda nice. So if you lose one, it's really not super expensive out of your pocket. But, uh, you know, it still, it still hurts to lose a lure, especially if you really like it. All right, let's throw them up the riffles here. We never really fish these all that much. Let's give it a shot. Fish on, fish on, check it out, man, I told you. Got me fishing the riffles. All right, hopefully I catch them to the shore because I don't have my net. Get my hands wet, another hand wet. Check it out, guys, there we go. Tried the little teeny gold because I wasn't working for anything else. First brown trout of the day. Look at the size of that little dude, but hey, what the heck, it's a fish. And there's the spinner, and yeah, I don't know, at least spinners work so good. All right, dude, there we go. Hopefully this camera's turned on. Oh, it is, all right, there we go. First fish of the day, just a puny little tater tot. Later, dude. Whew, that was fun. Well, that's all it took, huh? Nothing. All right, well, we caught one. Oh, we almost, oh, we almost fell down too. Whoa. I hate rocks. Oh, I hate rocks. Well, there's your trout dance. Jeez. Oh, my God. What a pain. I tell you, mud gets to be a pain when you're out here. Let's see if anything takes this little lure. It goes crazy with it. I catch fish? It looks like it. Something hit it. Oh, something hit it again. Oh, got one, guys. Got one. All right, what's this? Woohoo! Got me another one. All right, no net. Oh, and he got away. All right. That's what happens when you don't have a net. All right, I caught him. Woohoo! Got another one. Man, I forgot my net. Fish on, boys and girls, fish on. Oh, hopefully I don't lose them. Well, I got this guy. Check it out, guys. Oh, he fell off too, that's hilarious. He weighs what he's about, let's see, he weighs. He's approximately, well, actually he's a keeper, but I'm gonna send him on his way and season is until next week. Thanks a lot for playing, dude, that was fun. Wee. Yeah, there's a feeding zone over there if you can hit it right. But you just gotta get right in that zone. The kind of that zone is like right over. Yeah, you're kind of off of that right there where I just landed. Fish on, boys and girls. Fish on again. Ah, oh, awesome. Oh, well. There you go. That's two and a half. Well, that goes to three now because the two, two point fives equal one fish. That's hilarious. All right. The ups and downs and the disappointments, I tell you. Fish on, boys and girls. Fish on. I'm hoping I get this guy to shore. This one's a decent one too. Well, he's not massive, but he's pretty. All right. We'll get this guy over here. Hands are wet. We gotta get him over here, dude. Check it out, man. There we go. Another brownie on a little gold spinner. A little teeny thing. Well, he just really engulfed it good. He got right, well, actually he got right in his top lip. Check it out right there. It's just like a nice, easy release. I love these hooks, dude. They're like my favorite thing ever. I wish I had done this years ago. Anyways, there you go. Another brown trout. Great day so far. 
getting better and better. There it goes, heading downstream into the current. Whew, that was fun. This is okay, okay. I tell you, a okay, man. This is a okay. Fish on, fish on again. Taking them to the grass. All right, check it out. Another brown trout. Quit flopping, dude. We'll have you off quick. All right, dudes and dudettes. There we go. Hooked in the mouth with the hook. Single hook. See, I'm telling you, this is a great way to fish for trout. That popped out of there in 10 whole seconds flat. We turned around here and we'll get him into the water and get him released. Later, dude. Thanks for visiting. Well, see, that's fun. I'm having a great day. Fish on again. This is a nice one. Or is this a small puny one like the other ones? Oh, this is not a bad fish. What is this? Is this a brook trout this time or a brownie again? All right. Oh, and it flew off. All right. There we go, guys and girls. A little brownie. Gonna get him back in the water here. Later, dude. Oh, he's heading downstream, so he's not gonna get up there and tell anybody else that I'm here. So maybe I have a chance at catching another one. Fish on, boys and girls, fish on again. Probably a puny little peanut. He'll probably come off before he gets to me. But I don't have a net, so I'm probably gonna lose him. There he is. Not a giant. Come here, chucklehead. Please don't fall off. All right. He was hooked to the nose. There was no way he was getting off. Look at that, beautiful. Turn him this way, you guys probably see him way better. All right, we'll get this guy free. <sighs> right in your lip, dude, that was so awesome. All right, where's he going? He's behind the camera right now. Boy, oh boy, he just wanted to come with me. All right, you're going home. Later, dude. There he goes, down, down, down. Oh, no, he's swimming back upstream. All right, there he goes. He's gonna ruin the spot for me. Chucklehead. Nope, nothing happening. All right, let's get around here. Had a couple strikes and that was it. So. Well, there we go. I think I, need, I was a little hot anyways, I guess. It kind of cooled me off a little bit. Jeez. Well, whatever. I just get my sleeve dry here. The water out of my sleeve. Uh, all right, whatever. At least it's 8.32 below zero. You guys wet? I hope not. All right, maybe you are. I am. What a pain, I tell you. Huh. Something was happening. Well, wow, there's like a lot of rocks here. So who knows what that could have been. Fish on, guys and girls, fish on. He's trying to swim downstream from me. So you up here by my feet now. I might lose this guy anyways. And when they start flopping on that single hook, they're gone. But nope, this guy didn't get away. All right, there we go. Another brownie. Came down from Brown Town to visit Slayer Mike in Lower Town. All right, dude. See you later, squirminator. That's weird, this one lure caught all the fish. If I'd have lost this guy, would I have caught more fish? Maybe, but not very likely. Wow, that was pretty awesome. Okay, let's keep moving. Whoa, slippery rocks through here, I tell you. Yeah. What the heck is that? I haven't seen that in like two weeks. We got the sun, it warmed things up. When I first got in that creek, it was like 38 degrees. It was miserable. I hiked in there a little ways, didn't catch anything. I switched out to that teeny weeny little spinner, nonstop fish from beginning to end. 
And you know the funny thing about this whole trip is I forgot to bring my net. I left it at home. I got out there and like reached down. And I thought, oh no, I don't have my net. I left it at home. Jeez, how dumb was that? <sighs> I took everything out of the truck the other day. We had some stuff going on in our garage. We had to park outside. I didn't want to have a whole bunch of stuff in the back, so I left it in the house, you know. And there's my net at the house. Ah. Uh -huh. Anyways. I got to say it was a fantastic day. Once I put that little teeny spinner on, non-stop fish. Once I took it off, I tried to put a bigger spinner on there, thinking that maybe it's a little gold to catch a fish, maybe the bigger gold to catch a bigger fish, you know? But of course, nothing. I just cast, 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 and nothing happened, so I just gave up. Went back to that little spinner again, boom! Non-stop fish again. I don't know. Maybe it's just what they were looking for. They're looking for something small and easy to eat instead of like something big that they'd have to chase and kind of attack, you know? So who knows? Anyways, thank you for tuning in. Thanks for tagging along. There's going to be a head over here. There's going to be a playlist over here. Go check out the tips, tricks, and techniques of places I fish in the driftless, places I fall down. Like today, I fell down twice. My one arm got soaking wet, and then the second time, it got all the way wet up to my shoulder, and it was just like sopping and dripping, and it was terrible. Anyways, head, playlist, talk to you on the next episode. Thanks for tuning in. Later, gators.